So hello, my name is Dark Moon Doll. This is part two of the video I just made. It just kind of blanked out. I was pretty much saying goodbye to you guys. Um, yeah, feel free to come to my Etsy shop. Um, it's www.darkmoondoll.etsy.com. And you can go to my Instagram. My Instagram is www.instagram.com slash darkmoondoll. And on, on my Instagram, I post up-to-date um, pro projects that I'm working on. And I've been wanting to get a tutorial up on to Patreon. Just haven't had the time. I'm so busy. But you can check out my Patreon also. Um, and I'll try to remember to leave the link to that in the description below. So yeah, um, I think we should all be creative. Definitely. And this is what I showed on part one. Was that this doll is on sale. And I've been working on this for quite a while. And I've been sharing this with you in a few videos on this channel. The process of making this bottle doll. It's an altered bottle doll and it's spiritual in nature it's not a toy a lot the, all the dolls that I make aren't meant to be toys just letting you know they are spiritual items that they are sacred they're created by the energy of my hands and they're not to be played with they're to be displayed you know on your altar somewhere where they can't get damaged so I spend a lot of time on these creations so I hope that you guys when you buy them you respect them as much as I respect them after I cre finish creating them so just thought I'd throw that out there <laughs> and then the other thing was this purse that I finished it's a um, conjoined twin purse that I created uh, it took me quite a while over a year <laughs> because it's all paper beads but this is on my channel I mean on my channel <laughs> it's on my Etsy shop so um, I have it on sale now and Definitely remember that with each purchase you get a free um, You get a free handmade gift because like I said, I'm trying to Trying to get rid of a lot of stuff trying to sell some things um, Can't really afford to give away uh, my heavier <laughs> You know me my Creations that take a long time to do but I will give you a handmade uh, gift along with your purchase and these aren't the only items that are on my shop. I have other items on my shop that I've been putting up. I've been putting up items on my Etsy shop just about every day. So, um, yeah. So just want to let you guys know about that. And feel free to check it out. Um, I'm always updating, putting new things up, uh, talking about new creations. You could even go to uh, my Twitter, my Facebook. Um, yeah. And like I said, um, if you uh, want to support this channel, you can donate a dollar or more to my PayPal at kdaddytmama at comcast.net. And with that donation, I can answer a question on an upcoming show pertaining to art or even perhaps do a tutorial of your choosing. Um, check out my Patreon too, and you can donate to my Patreon as well so I can do tutorials on that as well. I've done a lot of tutorials on this channel for free. Um, this is not a requirement for you to watch these videos. You don't have to pay for anything. It's just people have asked how can they support this channel and that's how you can support this channel. One of the ways you can support this channel. So yeah, I really I really encourage people to express themselves as long as well as they can and not feel like they have to create a certain type of artwork in order to be considered as an artist. I mean there's so many different types of art out there. I mean like I showed you in part one, if you catch part one, oh let me bring it over. The part one, this is a, a creation that I did on a tutorial on this channel, which you can find. And it's an African uh, tribal art doll. It's, uh, you can use it on your altar or you can hang it up over your altar. And it's a very heavy piece. Um, but it's all expression, you know. And it's amazing what comes out when you're just being creative and taking your time out to have that quiet, that quiet time for just you, yourself and your creative energies. So thank you for joining me for the second part <laughs> of this video. My camera cut out because my phone's charging, but I wanted to do this video to get a video out for our Art Talk today, because I know there's a lot of people that are having a lot of frustrating times right now. And I'm just telling you that this is one of the many ways is that I get through these frustrating, challenging times I create art. And the art helps me to problem solve and figure out things that I wouldn't normally figure out if I'm just stuck in anger, rage, or, or depression, or whatever. So, yeah. Thank you for joining me, guys. Um, 
brightest blessings to you all, and I will see you guys soon.